Whenever a surfer takes off on their waves, they must decide whether to drop to the bottom to perform a bottom turn or turn to drive horizontally across the wave face to race a long section. If a surfer decides to drive across the wave, they should straighten their body and lift both arms forcefully in the direction they want to go to create horizontal acceleration. This lifting of the arms in conjunction with the straightening of the body creates a lift force which unweights the surfboard allowing it to accelerate faster than if the arms were not used. This results in the surfer creating maximum acceleration and speed to be used when executing their first major manoeuvre of the ride. The three times that this technique should be used are at takeoff as part of the standing action, after manoeuvres performed when you need to pick up speed to get to the next manoeuvre section quickly, when surfing through fat sections to help maintain your speed and drive. It should be understood that the creation of this horizontal speed is important in many surfing situations. There is a danger, however, that surfers focus too much on speed and forget about performing manoeuvres. To avoid developing this surfing style, surfers should adhere to the rule, one throw, two throws maximum, then look to perform a manoeuvre. By adhering to this rule, surfers are always looking to turn their horizontal speed into vertical speed at the earliest possible moment.